Some of humanity's greatest adventures began here at Launch Complex 39A at NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida. Astronauts lifted off from this pad six times between 1969 and 1972 to walk upon the lunar soil. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Riding Saturn V rockets, the astronauts left Florida and the Earth behind for two weeks while they ventured to the moon. In 1981, Pad A began hosting the world's first reusable spacecraft, NASA's space shuttles, on missions that would make working in space more commonplace while still achieving breathtaking science and accomplishing engineering feats that would have been out of reach before. The launch complex hosted shuttle missions for 30 years, including the first and last missions for the reusable orbiters. And lift off, the final lift off of Atlantis, the shoulders of the space shuttle, America will continue the dream. Roger roll, Atlantis. Houston now controlling the flight of Atlantis. Space shuttle spread. Since that final shuttle mission, SpaceX overhauled the pad extensively and refurbished storage tanks and other equipment there. The company also built a hangar at the base of the pad pyramid to handle processing of the rockets. Although the modifications were wide-ranging, the changes to the pad were slight compared to the work that went into constructing the facility. In the 1960s, NASA built a pair of launch complexes suitable for the needs of the world's first moon rocket, the Saturn V and its Apollo spacecraft. When it lifts off from Pad A to deliver supplies to the space station, the SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket will bring a new dawn for the venerated launch complex. This will be the first mission not operated by NASA to fly from Launch Complex 39A, as SpaceX takes the reins for the first time since at least the pad from the space agency. Future missions include launching commercial spacecraft. Eventually, Astronauts are to launch from the pad again, too. The great American gateway to space stands ready again to make history. Each mission is expected to set a new brick in the pathway to space that began at Launch Complex 39A.